portable fee. Yeah. I know when I've hired artists for stuff, it's been like 20 to $40 an hour. Yeah. And depending on what you ask him to do, it might be two hours or it might be 20. Right. <laughs> and, and it can really get expensive. Oh, I know. I got uh, Waters doing our, our templates. He's been working on 20 uh, F-18 mm. templates. He said he's got about 60 hours into it. Yep. I'm like, yes, I think I got maybe, maybe 15 hours into the, the delivery API, and a lot of that was just refactoring and testing. Yes. So much testing. It should be secure as long as our secrets don't leak. Right. And there's no oh, way I'm gonna hit the. I'm gonna hit the thing. Ah, oh, damn oh, it! I, I couldn't pull up. I was too heavy. Oh, no. Let's try that again. because I know you're already in theater. I got a bad guy. If you need to, egress and head uh, back to the house, and the Sams will, uh, will help take care of him. Yeah, I think, yeah. I, I think I got a shot on him. If I yeah, can. yeah, you're inside the Sam ring. Yeah. He's low, too. Oh, I see him on the data link, Angels 3. Right. To the east. Yep. Uh, bring him a little Uncle Sam package. Yeah. <laughs> he needs some freedom. I think he's... Uh, I see M, so you've missiled on him. Yep. And Fox 3. I don't know what it is. Definitely hostile. Definitely is. Yeah, once you get active, I would crank one or the other. We did a little uh, BVR clinic with uh, DCS Red Flag before the last operation. Yeah. They were they're trying to set up a scenario where both sides would be risk averse. Yeah. And so they said their their ideal outcome is everyone runs out of missiles and no one dies. Right. <laughs> Which was kind of disappointing and boring <laughs> in its own way, but we it. did it. And oh hell yeah. But before we did that mission, he, he did a, a training, uh, Cream, the CEO over there, and uh, we talked about some, like, tactics and then specifically comms, uh -huh. and it was pretty cool. I, I learned some, learned some good shit. Yeah, I need to, I need to refresh her up on some of this stuff. Well, I'm hoping, like, I want to go out to all these other slightly more mill simi communities. Yeah. Like I personally like a little bit of Milsim. I do too. But a lot of CAG and the relaxed vibe I've created has attracted people that are anti Milsim. Yes. So I'm gonna go out to these Milsim slightly more Milsim groups and then like take back lessons learned and then figure out how to Yeah. How to distill it down into something that's kinda gamified and easily digestible that doesn't make people feel like they're working a job. Right. Right. That's that's the key. Yeah. That is the key. It's a challenge because so many DCS groups feel like you're you're working a damn job. I know. Like, that's not what I'm about. Right, neither. I do enough of that. Yeah. God, yeah, I got 60 hours on my timesheet last week. <laughs> yeah. I had a shit week, too. <laughs> yeah, you, well, and you've had a couple in a row because you've had stuff kind of... I know, you, you've seemed really stressed, and I know you've talked about a couple of different challenges you're facing. I'm with doing skins uh, and with yeah, Fox 3, like, and then with your job. and Yeah, they got me billable, and I'm doing consulting. I'm doing uh, I'm doing all kinds of stupid shit. <laughs> I mean, oh, man. tracking hours. And they got me on an R&D project for uh, ChatGPT. 
I'm making, That's cool. I'm making chat GPT assistants that are specialists. I would love to learn more about how that tech works. I could teach I, you. I have a lot of information. I've been working that for weeks. And I love oh it. Man, yeah. I, I want to be able to use it more. I'd like to use it we're more with Fox 3. From, we're forbidden from using it at work. Because yeah. security is such a concern. Yep. They're like, don't even copy-paste a wow. code snippet into that thing. Wow. Now, you know uh, what? I can show you how to set up your own chat GPT running locally without an internet connection. That would be awesome. Yeah. And it's I easy. Know that. Yeah. Uh, the trouble is you have to do, you have to find the right model. The models are... Uh, you have to find the best coding module. If you want to find one for Java or, you know, JavaScript, yeah. you can do that. Because I don't have the I don't have the hardware to train a model. Yeah. Well, you don't. Have, so you the beautiful thing is, if you get the if you get the model downloaded, and you find the right one. It's you don't really have to train it at all. That's cool. Yeah. I did some stuff with like. TensorFlow and yep. Python. Yeah. Uh, God, it's probably been ten years. Yep. And and there was like a there was this tutorial that had an uh, there was a VM you could download. And and it had the model on it, and then you would train this model to do. Uh, I think it was it recognized certain types of flower petals. Uh huh. That's cool. And and so you had like this. 200 gig archive of photos of flower petals that you would train it through and and then you would you would just go find random shit on the internet and and it would identify the flowers that's pretty cool. um and that was pretty neat but that was that was just machine learning with tensorflow Magnum. so it's not anywhere near the level of like large language models right no i i made one so uh i i had this idea since we hey, you got a bandit on your right, Angels 22, Copy. about uh, 20 miles. Copy. I had this idea of doing a moving towards him. Chat, G chat GPT assistant that would be a progress guy, right? Yeah. Because nobody well, knows two ship. progress. Okay, I'm hitting. Uh... I recommend you go left and let me engage him from your rear. Copy. Like I'm coming up behind you. You could either do a full right hand and come into me, Copy. or you could do a left hand and extend away from us, both. How far are they? Oh, I About see. About thirty miles I from you now. Yep. Uh, I get one of them. I'll take the front one. How's that? Sounds good. Turn it in. And box three. Nice. Alright, I got the guy in the back. I wasn't going fast enough, so hopefully that'll hit him. Now I'm going to break because I got to be engaged. Those are mirages. I'm going back in. <laughs> They're finding my jammer. I forgot my jammer. Shit. Box three again on the first one. Yep, I'm getting into range. I'm Mach 1. 10,000 feet and climbing. I got the rear guy targeted. Okay, I'm breaking because he's fired. I'm going defensive. Yep, there's another friendly to our south if you need to push towards him. Sorry. I killed the uh, SA-6. Nice. Musa. Yeah, you got a cub and a mirage. Oh, nice. Killed a mirage. Still got one yeah, more back got, there. Yep, there's one more back there. I'm about to get a, get a good solution. And Fox 3 managed solution. Uh, uh, <laughs> turn it back in. That's a joke uh, I'll make with one sometimes. <laughs> Uh, somebody will say box three, and then I'll just go manage solutions. <laughs> box three. Now west. Okay. I'm defending. Gotcha. Looks like Pitbull. Got I am out. Look that. <laughs> Looking for the ground targets now. Here to ground. I 
think I spoofed that missile. I don't think it'd be that hard in those barrages, sir. Did I get him? Oh, he's not dead. Kid. I don't see a kill in the kill log. And I don't see my missile anymore. Alright, let me look. For him. Oh, there he is. He's real close. Holy He's shit. still out there? Yeah. He's and low. I'm coming back in. Got him. Yeah. Alright, I got you on my HMD because I've got you data link locked. Uh, Alright, yep, I see him at Angels 12. 12. Yep, Roger, that's him. Box 3. Yeah, he's really close to you. Yeah, Damn. I just fired. I'm supposed to be protecting you. That's not Splash. Too well. Kaboom. Nice. Yeah, it took me three planes to get up and... <laughs> well, you said it had been a while. Yeah, so. you know me. Every time I get in a plane, yeah. it's been a while. <laughs> Okay, going back to the targeting pod. Let's see if I can lot drop these 105s. Yeah. So you can lock something on the head if you have it. Okay. And you can drop those on that contact as well. But not they're not going to be as accurate. So I'll lock something with the head and then pull up the targeting pod. Zoom in and then fine tune it. And then go up to altitude. I might even turn cold. Nice. And extend, and then come back in, you know, above the clouds and drop. Because once you have it on the TGP, it's INS locked. Okay. So just you just don't touch it until you're ready to drop, and you're good to go once you've locked it. Just, just a trick for you know not ha not having to rush it in one yeah. approach. Yeah. And, and sometimes I'll even do laps like. Uh, outside of the target area and just try to get the TGP on things before I go in and I'll make work points. I'm at 2,000 pounds of fuel, so I gotta... Oh, yeah. So Abu, those things out there. Abu Musa, or Sir Abu. Where, where are we going? Oh, Noir. Yeah, is that where we're going? To the southeast. Oh, we were going to Abu Musa. I went to the wrong Yeah, we're doing Abu Musa. Okay. That's what I was going to the wrong, uh, wrong island. Yes, your point one three. Your points. One, three, enter. Now, once you hit enter and it's got the steer point in, shouldn't it be something on your HUD? If you're in nav mode. Oh, okay. That's my problem. So if you go into nav mode, you'll see a little tadpole indicating the direction to your target. Right. Or, or your, your selected steer point. So, it should be in nav mode. Oh, there it is. I see it. Okay. Going it also to works in air to air as well. I just noticed. Target pod. And the target pod's there. Gosh, I love that. Yeah. All right. Yeah, and uh, if you get the, your target pod all weird, you need to go back. Yeah. Unless you have something locked on another sensor to make it a speed, yeah. you can just hit um, TMS aft short, and the TGP will slave back to your selected steer point. Nice. Otherwise, it's going to go to your sensor speed from whatever other sensor you've got stuff locked on. See, that's the I'm other thing. Angels I don't know if I have. Nine go ahead, sorry. I'm at Angels 19. I'm approaching Abu Musa. I've, there's a bunch of boats north of it. Yep. Um, and I see those Ivanovs out there. Oh, I, got, I got clouds in the way. Yeah, there's a lot of clouds. Okay. So, I can see the field. Is there anything I want to blow up over there? I think there's some SAMs on the north side of the field. Yep, SA-15 locking. And, uh, and they have fired. Got it. I see one, okay. Alright, so... I'm out cold. Get up. Air to ground. Thank God for this little hole in the clouds. It's a nice viewport onto the island. Man, they fired two at me. They're 
They like you. They're feeling rude. Alright. There it is on me. It's that was supersonic. I just heard you pass under. I was 15. I thought I killed this little bitch. Okay, I don't have reinforce. I'm turning. I don't have a harm. I had the harm, so I fired it. Okay, so I got that thing locked. I'm looking, why don't I have a bomb drop thing? Oh, because I'm on the wrong right. thing. Because I'm a dumbass. Oh. Viz mode, right? Yep. Okay. Uh, Viz or pre? Let's try pre. Uh, Viz will let you do helmet mounted queuing. Pre okay. will just anything you lock in the TGP. Okay. But the same, it, also in Viz, anything you lock in the TGP. Raj. If you want to do helmet queuing, you put it in Viz, you make the TGP soy, you press display management up short, and you'll yeah. see an asterisk in the top left of the HUD, and then you'll press TMS, uh, target management switch, forward long, and then somewhere on your, uh, on your HUD you'll see a little box, and then you can TMS forward short to drop that box on something you're looking at. And then you you go back to your TGP and it's looking there. Huh. I use it a lot for um, close air support. Yep. Because then I, you know, if I can just get the TGP on it and put the little box, SA 15. So I have that guy locked. Oh, you fired. Yep. And, yep, you got me. Oh. They were too many. Alright, I got a, I got a Q. Oh, I'm so impressed that the engine stays on for so long. After being... There it goes. Now oh. we're up here. Oh, oh it didn't fall. Fuck. So you only got two on your wings. Yep, oh, it's coming, it's coming. Brake, brake. Brake harder. Change directions. Oh, oh, Jesus uh. <laughs> you know what I need to do? I need to go back and do some, something with these. Uh, evasion. Evasion Miss, yeah, missile evasion. Especially on the SA-15. The 15.